As a 2018 model, Hyundai introduced its compact Kona crossover in 2017. The Kona has changed over time, helping Hyundai enter the battery electric vehicle market and expanding. The over-the-top end lineup. As information about the redesigned second generation begins to trickle out, it now appears that the Kona's days are numbered. According to Hyundai, its next generation Kona design began with EV models and was later adapted for internal combustion models. Adding to that, the new Kona is bigger, bolder, and more upscale. The Korean automaker has only confirmed that we can anticipate an EV, hybrid, and N-line model for the new Kona. It hasn't said which powertrains will be available. It's hard to say which engines Hyundai will use, but we hope the 2.0-liter turbocharged i4 from the N model stays. It's hilarious and fun. We anticipate that the Kona will use components from its popular Ionic EV line for its electric vehicle offerings. There are some concrete details about the Kona's new shape, but there aren't many details about the powertrain. The Kona of the second generation will be roughly an inch wider and 5.9 inches longer than the model that is currently available. Hyundai increased the length of the Kona by 2.4 inches in order to take advantage of the extra length. Between the axles of this stretched crossover, there should be more room for passengers and cargo. The redesigned Kona's interior follows the growing trend of sharp creases in sheet metal. Ambient lighting and two 12.3-inch infotainment screens on the dash lend the vehicle a futuristic feel. The switch to a column-mounted shifter may be the most significant interior modification. We can anticipate additional details closer to the vehicle's launch in 2023, according to Hyundai. We will also have to wait for the price. It is likely that the outgoing model sticker price of $23,285 will not be retained in this period of rapid inflation. The Ford Bronco Sport and Volkswagen Taos are more recent models than the Kona, making the Kona an important entry into a very competitive small crossover segment. According to Ward's intelligence data, Hyundai sold 45,680 Konas during the first three quarters of this year, a 46% decrease from the same period in 2021. With 115,344 sales, the Subaru Crosstrek dominated the market, followed by the Honda HRV, 92,555 sales.